What's up guys? Um, so good morning, good evening, good afternoon. Uh, so right now I'm downtown. Um, after this, I'm gonna head to a restaurant called Bun Mi King. And yeah, it's an Asian restaurant, but specifically I wanna go there for this dessert. I, it's like a honey toast dessert with, I believe it has like ice cream in it with toppings on top like strawberries or matcha or chocolate. Uh, I will definitely explain the ingredients when I get to the restaurant. Apologize for the lighting. Yeah so like I've been wanting to try this dessert for a very long time but I just I don't know I'm never really in the area and now that uh, we're in the area I'm gonna go check it out and I will see you guys there. <laughs> So this part is the honey toast. Um, I believe this is mint, <laughs> strawberries, whipped cream, um, some stickles, um, and then some strawberry sauce. And then inside there's actual actual ice cream, cream, whipped cream, and some evaporated milk. Uh, I, I was told. <clears throat> and yeah, it took a while for for it to come up. Okay, so I'm. <clears throat> actually matcha inside. I thought it was like vanilla ice cream. So there's matcha, matcha, and oh, some more um, honey honey toast on the bottom. Oh my god, this is huge. Oh yeah, and it's really warm inside. Mm, okay, taste test. I'll try to get a bit of everything. So this. It's really sour just because of the strawberries but let me change this matcha again mm. and the honeycomb it tastes um the honeycomb 
to be honest, is not yeah. so, not too soft. I don't know if they like overcooked it in the oven or something like that, because it's really hard and like it's not super flaky and like soft inside, but. God, this is so big. Look, look how big it is compared to my head. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh yeah, and so inside there's actually some honey. What else is in there? Oh my god. Mmm. Mmm. This bread inside at the bottom is so good. It's better than like the honeycomb that's surrounding it. It has like a honey taste and like, I'm not sure what that is. This is so much, but... level I feel like this is a mukbang right now yeah like sweetness level <clears throat> for me personally it's not super sweet yeah it's definitely not as it's definitely not as sweet as the tiramisu snow that I tried last week like this one I can probably eat more of oh look and there's even red bean there's red bean ice cream too oh cool oh. And I love red bean ice cream. Mm. Okay, never mind. It's actually really sweet. <laughs> I'm just trying to pick at the middle here because it's so good. Like it tastes like um I think it's honestly I think it's a cinnamon bun inside. Oh that's why. I'm like, what is it? I'm like, it's so good. Cinnamon bun. A cinnamon bun inside. <clears throat> I feel like you would need to eat this with at least like two to three people. It's definitely a lot to, to eat on your own. I'm sharing this dessert and like we can't even finish half of it. Like um, I think we could, I think three or four people can finish this dessert. I mean, it's a lot. Definitely need to chase this with water. <laughs> I think we're like about to give up. It looks like soup at this point. Alright, so what do I rate this place? Okay, well, I can't rate the entire place on its own. I can only um, rate it solely on its on the dessert. The dessert, I honestly rate it like a six out of ten. Um, I rate it a 6 out of 10 um, just because I feel like there was a lot going on in that dessert like there's like two types of ice cream like some sauce and like some whipped cream and um, what else was there uh, there's like a cinnamon like two cinnamon buns inside plus cream plus like stickos on top with strawberries which were very sour what I did like about um, the dessert was the cinnamon bun the staff there was really nice like I've been there a couple times already but just um, just for the food not for the dessert definitely um, recommend going there like for the food I've only tried the bun meat but like I've heard um, reviews and from other people that their other food is good um, their salads their bubble tea which I usually get yeah the dessert took a while to come out because I think they they made it fresh for us so it took like about like a 10-15 minute wait so if you do if you do plan to get that dessert I would suggest getting it like right away when you when you get to the restaurant because I waited until I finished my sandwich and then I ordered which took another like 15 minutes and we spent more time than I wanted to <laughs> in that restaurant overall Dessert, 6 out of 10. Restaurant, I rate it like an 8 out of 10. So I just got back, my phone died. Are you gonna join me? So that wraps up vlog number 4. And Sadie decided to join me. If you want to know everything that I ate and all the information, please look at my uh, description down below. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you guys have any suggestions on what I should eat next, uh, please leave a comment down below. 
or let me know through Instagram. Uh, please share this video. And if you're already not subscribed, please subscribe to my videos. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Peace.